Baez taking the set pieces in place of the native Austinite fan favorite, Guadarrama. And a miscue from Los Angeles. Tear pack strikes. You've got to agree with Junior Gonzalez there. Just committing too many fouls. If the referee is going to call it as tightly as he has, you have to make the adjustments, opportunities for Austin from the set piece. A turn and fire and a second one to pull even. And what a strike. Carlos Harvey, he had a rocket in the first half that soared over the crossbar. And this time, another blast. Restrepo, I don't think he ever saw it to see as a response early in the second half. The shot deflected off Taylor right to Harvey. And Harvey does the smart thing, wastes no time, puts the shot off. And now Restrepo may be tested once more. And all of a sudden, this one really starting to pick up box-to-box -box action. Able to find space, taken down, and a penalty coming up. One of the easier decisions for a referee pointing to a spot. That could very well change in a matter of moments here. They have not had the chances here in the second half. Atua Hene making almost instant impact and coming off the bench wins the corner. The Jamaican with his left boot. Tear pack. Yeah. Off the crossbar. Lopez with the answer at least for another moment. Twice Eric Lopez there. Now, L.A. has been playing in fairly good form now recently after that great dry spell from May into June. Well, Austin was down two defenders before this match ever got started because of yellow card accumulation. That is two yellows, and we'll do the math for you before the first day of school, boys and girls. On the wing. And they will call... The foul on Austin. The man who equalized it, made it a 1-1 game, and just able to overtake Jermaine and Taylor, and now oh, Taylor. Taylor gets a straight red. Most dos, no obligation to take a shot here. Possession valuable. Instead, there is your nail in the coffin. A one to nothing lead. The second half has all been for the visitors from Los Angeles. Austin led by one at halftime. Los Dos found the equalizer as they almost instantly came out of the locker room. Three second half goals, and Junior Gonzalez's men have now won three of their four last matchups.